One of the most common questions I get as a life coach working with women who are trying to develop more fulfilling relationships with other women is, how do I find friends as an adult? This can be challenging because we are not in the school or college or sometimes even workplace environments where we might be meeting friends. A lot of people are working from home these days and you know we're just not always surrounded by a lot of people. So how do you find friends as an adult? Well, this answer is actually twofold. The first part is that I want for you to really look and see how you are contributing to your current relationships, okay? I want for you to take that radical responsibility and look at all of the relationships in your life and see, is there a disconnection? Now, there may or may not be. You may have just moved or you may have gone through a spiritual awakening and have found yourself really needing a new group of people to connect with. You may have gone through a divorce. You may have started a new job. There's lots of reasons as an adult why we might be in need of new, beneficial, mutually entertaining and enjoyable friendships. But I, you have to really start by looking at how are you contributing to any disconnection that you are currently experiencing in the relationships that you do have. This can be a little difficult if you've never done that before. You might be thinking, well, it's not my fault, it's their fault. We got in an argument and I'm not talking to that person anymore. That's completely fine. But you've got to do the work of looking beneath those layers and seeing how you played a role in that disconnection. Because what's gonna happen is that you're going to eventually have a whole new group of friends in your life. And if you didn't learn your lesson with the past friend or the past group of friends, you're gonna have to face that once again when it comes to the new friends in your life. Remember, your problems are gonna continue to recycle until you face them. And the way is to go through, not around. So how are you contributing to any disconnection or how have you contributed to disconnection in the past with friends? And look there first and see what you need to own and what you need to change in your life. From there, you will have established a new energy, a new way of seeing things. And as you go along this journey, the friends that show up in your life once you've done the work will be responding differently to that new energy that you're vibrating with. Now, this may have not been the answer that you were looking for, but that's a start. The second part I would say is make sure you are getting out there. Don't be afraid to shoot somebody a DM on Facebook or Instagram who you've been wanting to connect with or who looks interesting or who you think that you would get along with. I've actually had a friend do that to me before when uh, she actually moved to my area and we connected and we hung out so many times and even our kids became friends. So you just never know. Don't be afraid to reach out and start looking at what your interests and hobbies are and dive deep into those. Join clubs, sign up at gyms, have some ideas in mind that you'd like to go on friend dates with. So when you meet a new friend, you can say, hey, do you want to go kayaking with me at this river I've been wanting to hit up or I've been wanting to check out this coffee shop in downtown in the downtown area do you want to you know grab a cup of coffee next Saturday afternoon so get that lined up get some ideas brewing and look at yourself first 
and then take action on finding your new friends. They are coming, I promise.